Be my first gold record was with 783, yeah, in 88. My first group before Cyprus. I actually knew Cyprus because Cyprus was, it was our neighborhood. We were all friends. We hung out. But I met these kids from Brooklyn and they asked me to DJ for them. So I went with them. And that's how I learned the music business because they had a record out already. We didn't know shit about the music business. We didn't know fucking what a studio looked like. We didn't know what a fucking drum machine was. You know, we didn't know shit. There wasn't no way to know this shit unless you knew somebody who had it. Uh, how how old were you then then in eighty eight eighty nine like um nineteen wow so that's young bro that's like but learning the business at that young an age you can kind of see like just you guys yeah when these motherfuckers tell when they when they tell me they're young now I talked to some kid the other day he's like I'm young I'm twenty five I was like. You old fool. Twenty <laughs> sixteen young, seventeen young. Mm-mm-mm. Maybe by twenty five you were like platinum. You were twenty five, you were platinum. By twenty man, I was a millionaire by twenty three. Shit, that's what I'm saying. This is this is the thing that we find like talking about the nineties, getting guests on, and we realised people were so young. Like you forget, like artists when they came out, they were like Nas was sixteen. And you know the difference was, man, if you had to go to the shit, you couldn't just look at the shit on YouTube or like watch this shit on TV. You had to go. You had to get on the bus. You had to figure out how to get to that party. Then you had to figure out how not to get robbed. And you know, you just and you had to figure out, you know, you had to you had to go to shit. You had to go to dangerous places to go listen to this music. Yeah, man. And sit there and watch. Then you know how you learn? You watched. Mm. And then that's how you learn. Then you went home and practiced, but there was no rewind and fast forward and nobody giving you hints because nobody wanted to tell you shit back then. They didn't want to let you in on the secrets. It wasn't telling you nothing. Nobody was telling you shit. 